What's up, y'all? It's Kale with Pumpkin Crunch. I'm at the grocery store today. Thanksgiving is coming up, and I've got three super easy, healthy recipes that we're gonna be making today with all of these yummy ingredients. So follow along, stay tuned, let's get cooking. So we're making three things today. First thing we're gonna be making is a kale chopped Caesar salad, topped with some pomegranate seeds, some almonds, all the pretty things. Next, we're doing bacon wrapped green beans, kind of like a little individual bite-sized green bean casserole situation. And then lastly, I said healthy, but it's not, but you gotta splurge a little bit. We're doing some crescent roll wrapped brie stuffed with pepper jelly. Very exciting, very delicious. First recipe we're making is a kale Caesar salad. Kale, like me. First step, all we're gonna do is prepare the kale. We're just gonna remove the stems, chop it. From there, we're making the dressing using these delicious things. And then lastly, we're gonna toss the salad, put some toppings on it, and it is done. Okay, so when you go to the grocery store, you're gonna buy a big bunch of fresh kale. I find this is best. And all we're gonna do to prepare it, it has a big stem along the line of the leaf. You're gonna remove the kale from the stem, super easy. And then you can either use a knife on your chopping board or I find it easier to put in a food processor and just blend it. Basically, you just wanna get the kale into super tiny little pieces for our salad. Our next step is the salad dressing. And this is a versatile salad dressing that you can really use on any salad. It is delicious. It's gonna be my take on a Caesar. And you can kind of doctor it up how you want. So main ingredients are gonna be olive oil. We have some fresh basil anchovies you might think mm, no but use it i promise they're good and then we have some lemon juice last step is going to be your toppings it can honestly go with just parmesan and croutons that's delicious by itself but i'm going to add a pop of color and crunch to it today with some slivered almonds and some fresh pomegranate seeds so then, why? And now you're going to beat the hell out of the first one. Look how beautiful this came out. This is 100% my favorite salad. It is so tangy and delicious, really perfect for anything. But since Thanksgiving's coming up, that's what you can make it for. If you like this recipe, don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. More to come.